Hey guys, this is Brian again. Um, it it's just really sad knowing that despite all the efforts of people trying to you know encourage these kids out there not to you know take their own lives, that we're still having kids committing suicide because of hate crimes and bullying. And I mean, it's just so sad, you know, because everyone's life is worth something to another person. And they have so much to themselves, so much talent, and they had a life ahead of them, and they took it. And it, it just really hurts. And um, if you didn't know, I found this news today. It was on Perez Hilton's uh, website, and it was also on the gay activism, gay rights website, too. But um, Corey Jackson, a uh, gay student at o Oakland University in Michigan, uh, committed suicide. He hung himself behind the school, and um, it, even though they say that he wasn't a victim of bullying, you know, he was still feeling lonely and depressed. And sometimes when you feel alone, no one is there to support you. You know, it takes a toll. And I think we just really right now need to, like show our care and support to people so that this doesn't happen again because it's getting worse and I don't like that and I doubt anyone else is um but if you have friends that are gay or if you're gay stick in there help them out and always be supporting uh today was purple day and I wore purple and uh it, it was kind of sad when, you know, I was talking to my friends and they forgot about today. I was like, oh no, but I mean, they said they'd wear purple tomorrow and they still support, you know, helping gay victims of bullying. And I just think it's good that people are supporting the activism to, you know, prevent these suicides. And so as I end this, I again want to give a moment of silence to those now seven kids that killed themselves and I pray that God will meet them up in heaven and they will live better lives up there